The last time Perseverance shot video of Ingenuity was September of 2021 for Flight 13. For Flight 47, the two were about 120 meters apart, close enough to capture Ingenuity lifting off in a cloud of dust. On this episode of Mars Guy, Perseverance and Ingenuity have been exploring the top of the ancient Jezero Delta, which is covered by alluvial fan deposits, some laid down by raging floodwaters. Perseverance arrived at this location on Sol 727. Here's Mars Guy for scale. Ingenuity was nearby, having already arrived 10 sols earlier. The sun orientation is just right to produce the strong glints off its twin carbon fiber rotors. Two sols after Perseverance arrived, Ingenuity took flight, number 47 of its originally planned five flight mission. It climbed to 12 meters hovering briefly, then tilted its rotors to head off to the southwest on a flight lasting 146 seconds, covering 440 meters at over 5 meters per second. The takeoff appeared to lift more dust than previous flights. This may be due to the late afternoon flight with the low western sunlight forward scattering off the airborne dust plume. Ingenuity's first flight appeared to generate no dust plume, but a grayscale view using motion filtering and a color view enhanced with this filtering clearly shows a similar dust plume. The full flight 47 was not observed by MassCam Z, but the reconstructed path is shown in this orbital view. Ingenuity's color camera captured this scene from near the end of the flight. It shows some unusual fracture patterns that perhaps were produced as the original sedimentary deposits dried out. There are also some finely layered rocks here. Only 10 frames from Ingenuity's nav cam have been downlinked so far, showing its autonomous hazard avoidance software choosing a safe landing spot. Perseverance again caught up to Ingenuity after following a circuitous path covering 600 meters arriving at its current location on Sol 736. For several weeks, a campaign of cloud monitoring has been going on, with sky observations generally at dawn and dusk. This paid off big time with observations looking east just before sunrise at about 520 local mean solar time. A set of eight images taken about 15 seconds apart shows the motion of these wispy clouds the most impressive ones yet observed by Perseverance. You might be surprised that the extremely thin atmosphere of Mars has clouds at all, but thin water ice clouds form every year for a few months around the summer solstice in the northern hemisphere. They're like cirrus clouds on Earth, but even thinner. Clouds have been observed by orbiting and surface spacecraft for decades, and they've even been documented with large telescopes on Earth since the 1800s. These clouds, along with the dust plumes produced by Ingenuity, and the fact that it can fly at all, reveal the presence of the meager atmosphere of Mars.